All right, hello everyone. Uh, we are going to do fizz buzz today. Um, fizz buzz is when a certain number hits by the code and it will output the fizz and another number output comes out and it will go buzz instead of a number. So we're going to start by doing a um, coding a uh, listing of the whole numbers from 1 through 100. So that's where we are going to start from there first. So for that, we're going to start with the for loops so that we can print out. So remember that for loop started with three sections. So we're going to declare the value as a let i you know, starting from 1. And then it's going to go up to, so we're going to count up to 100. So it means but up to 101 is uh, where we're going to be uh, going, numbers going up to. So i is going to be less than 101 because it will print up to 100. So that's our second, and then each i will add up to another one. So that's how we abbreviate as a i plus plus. And for this, we're gonna start actually by uh, printing numbers first. So since I'm gonna co uh, print in a doc document setting, which means HTML, not log, but we could actually start with the log. So we could put console log and then we just print i and what we do is we save that and output well as a html it's not going to show up you have to go into log so what we do is we right click go to inspect and then go to console console and then you'll see all the numbers print out from one all the way through 100 so we got that part right but i want to have it print out on the html sheet right so what do we do something we've been always doing and instead of that i'm going to give comment that out instead of that we can start typing the document okay we're going to printing out on the html document and going to write and put i so we're going to be printing out the numbers on the html document instead of a console so if we do that there you go so what's the difference? The numbers are all listed as a one line, and you can't tell whether it's one through hundred, right? It's kind of numbers are all buzzed up and jumbled up, not one line. So we have to uh, skip a line, like, like an enter, and then the one stays here, and two stays here, like how we console had a number listed up vertically. So I can do that by adding a tag break line tag right so we should save that here we go so we got a all numbers vertically lined up okay so we have the basic setup is done now what we have to do here is we want to have every threes to print out buzz letters b u z z instead of printing out three so we can start doing that by if statements so if <coughs> i is divisible by three okay and then by three but we don't want a remainder right and remainder is zero okay so whatever number that's divided by three and the remainder is zero if that happens i want it to print on a document so document print and then document write and we want to write a instead of a number we want to write bus Okay, so let's see what happens in like that. Okay, so I save it. There you go. So instead of three, there's a buzz. But what we have here is we want to have numbers and the line to be on the next line. So what do we do? We want to have, actually, we want the fizz, actually. Fizz instead. Then plus we want to go in that next line so we have to add a br code okay so that's where it is but look what we have here we have a third section where the number three should be is in face but we are still printing the whole number that's divisible by three so there's three here six here so what we have to do is we have to put on <coughs> 
another section of if which is else because if that number hits other than that we will be printing out other numbers right so if I do that there you go three goes away and then we can already see that six went away and then we get these right so we have the first uh, condition is correct now we want to have a buzz when we are divisible by five okay so the second condition that we'll put it we can put it in is by putting else if okay now at this time we want to have i is going to be divisible by five without remainders okay remainder is zero now we want to do document right and then we want to write buzz and then of course we want to have that line to be broken to the next line there you go so this will give out the buzz instead of 5 we should be writing a buzz instead of 10 you should be writing a buzz there you go so now we have it all the lines all the from 1 through 100 the program will divide 3 whenever there's a remainder of 0 it will put out a fizz and then going to br which is a break line and if not with in it all in it if not in a divisible by five and then in remainder is zero then it will go into buzz instead of writing whatever the multiples of fives and uh, any other else numbers will be outputting a number itself which is i represented by from here okay so pretty easy concept of for loop including a if statements. Thanks for watching for today.